The need for food assistance on Florida's first coast is staggering and increasing every day. Many local charities assisting those in need are struggling to respond to the rising demand. It's, it's very, very vital. Uh, so many people are hungry. Every day we, get, we take over 700 phone calls a month. We have more and more people coming every week. While people struggle to put food on the table, one-fourth of all the food in this country is thrown away, unsold every year. Thirty-one billion dollars worth of wholesome food is discarded annually despite the federal Emerson Good Samaritan law and state statutes which protect food donors and food rescue organizations from civil and criminal liabilities arising from donated food. Wholesome food goes to waste daily for a variety of reasons. Stores discard food when it approaches or reaches its sell-by date, even though it remains edible for many more days. Stores also throw food away when the packaging is damaged or the food is no longer cosmetically perfect or is overripe. In-date food and seasonal packaging and discontinued products are routinely thrown away. Perfectly good food regularly goes to waste simply because no one knows how to get it to someone who can use it in time. Waste not, want not exists to eliminate this paradox in North Florida. Waste not is a volunteer-based organization whose mission is to prevent the discarding of food that can be used to assist the needy. Since 1990, Waste Not, Want Not volunteers have been rescuing wholesome food from businesses and individuals willing to donate their unmarketable items. Every day, Waste Not volunteers, using their own vehicles, collect these donations and deliver them to Waste Not facilities in Orange Park. While most volunteers rescue two to eight shopping carts of food per trip, other teams transport thousands of loaves of bread at a time. All the rescued food is sorted and distributed, usually the same day it is received, to other tax-exempt charities serving those in need. Waste Not shelves are full in the morning and bare by early afternoon. More than 60 charities receive food from Waste Not Weekly, including missions and soup kitchens, food banks and food pantries, schools and after-school programs, group homes for challenged individuals, and churches feeding the homeless on the streets and in the woods. Waste Not currently makes over 80 rescues a week, averaging 2,000 pounds of food a day. 2,000 pounds of food that would be thrown away but for Waste Not's efforts. It is this focus on food rescue and helping charities, rather than on food drives to help individuals, that makes Waste Not, Want Not unique in North Florida. Working with Waste Not, Want Not is a great way to do something hands-on about the problem of hunger in our community. I could donate some money to a food bank or a few cans of food to, to a church, but by donating about an hour or two of my time every week, I can deliver an entire carload of food to needy recipients. I would encourage anyone to get involved with Waste Not, Want Not because um, it's just a win-win situation all the way around. Uh, the, Stores and the restaurants receive a tax benefit. Um, the charities in our area that feed the hungry are given good nourishing food and we get to have a great time helping to make it happen. If you are or know of a business or a person with food to donate locally, please contact Waste Not Want Not. Waste Not will attempt to rescue that food and distribute it promptly to those in need. Since 1990, the food rescued by Waste Not, Want Not has helped charities feed hungry families struggling to make ends meet, at-risk children, low-income seniors, and homeless men, women, and children in seven counties. Well, what's so exciting is the fact that we were looking around because we wanted to expand our ministry, our bread ministry, which we operate Monday through Friday. And now, because of Waste Not, Want Not, we have expanded that and we have great numbers like uh, Numbers for one month were 8,000 people served. So we're excited and we appreciate Waste Not, One Not because they helped us to uh, address the need of our community. All the more. Um, 
we're, we're living on Social Security. Uh, I'm disabled. She's disabled, so we can't even work a part-time job. So this helps fill in uh, a need right here close to the end of the month before uh, Social Security gets here. Uh, it means a lot to us. Waste Knots Help allows local charities to spend less on food assistance, leaving more funds for other critical services. I volunteer for a faith-based group, Downtown Ecla Medical Services in Jacksonville, and we help families in need with food, uh, financial services for utilities and rent, as well as clothing. And in the past two years, our organization has grown over 30% in our client base. We can offer more services to more people. So we go through roughly 150 loaves of bread a week with our organization. A waste not, want not fills that need. It saves us roughly six to $7,000 a year that we don't have to go in pocket for to supply a loaf of bread per family. So huge impact. Food rescue is a very cost-efficient way of providing food assistance. Waste Not distributes approximately 20 pounds of food for every dollar it spends, and over 96% of Waste Not's expenses are directly related to putting food in the hands of those in need. Your financial contribution to Waste Not, Want Not will help feed many hungry people in our community.